it is 8 16 a.m early as hell but today is the day that i'm going to my loctician class hold on it's so bright oh my god i can't even see i'm sorry for it's light in my face nah but today is the day that i'm going to get certified as a loctician i'm so excited y'all this really wasn't even on my like list and things to do in life like i never was like yeah i want to be a lactician but it's like people be asking me to do their locks right right so it's like why not just get certified and it's real quick you feel me get this as a skill under my belt and then i'm gonna be able to work in a shop or whatever and then i will be more professional looking because i'll have a certificate and i really know what i'm doing because like i know what i'm doing but like i could be better just so i could feel more comfortable because even when i do i did this woman's hair uh some days ago and she was like oh yeah you're a perfectionist and i was like yes ma'am like i don't play when i do people hair just because i don't want them to go home and be like okay i don't like this please take it out the only thing i don't like is that today is sunday so the class is on sunday from 10 to 5 i'm not tripping on learning i just feel like it being on a sunday like i like to chill on sundays y'all already know how i used to be when i used to work at target and i had to work on sundays like i don't like working on sundays but i ain't tripping because later on i'm going to this little concert thing i hope y'all can hear me because my uh hold on okay y'all but yeah so i'm really excited to learn because the loctician or the lock place i'm going to be learning at is like one of the top lock places in houston so i'm excited and y'all like my bonnet this company sent it to me and like this is not paid promo or anything but i really like this bonnet like ever since i got it i've been wearing it it's like the same as the other bonnets that i always used to wear and like the one that i'm giving away in my giveaway oh yeah speaking of my giveaway you guys already know the winner and she already knows herself that she's a winner but the giveaway is closed it is over we picked the winner already if you don't follow me on my lock page at lock lady 444 you would have seen who the winner was and yeah i will definitely be doing more giveaways in the future but it was so perfect because she when she reached out to me to get her prize she was like oh my god and i just started my locks like a month ago so it was like perfect for her and i want to start doing more like starter lock videos because a lot i get so many dms and like questions about starter lock so the only thing i just be really hard on myself like i'll make a video and i just be like mm, i don't really like it like i feel like i should have did this or i feel like i should have did that so it's like i'm trying to get out of that space where i'm trying to just be too perfect i don't know i just be like i just be trying to give y'all a lot of information and i want my videos to be valuable i don't want them to just be some lollygagging shit and then y'all can peep it like okay she's just draw making videos i'm not saying that's what i do but like when i be watching back my videos i feel like i could have said more i could have did more so i don't know i mean i have a video that's already up like i could post that whole right now but it's like i low key kind of want to remake it but i don't know we'll we'll see i like vlogs just because like it's not structured it's just like i can talk whatever on the way home and i will hit y'all either when i get there or when i'm done or when i pull up to the place so i'll hit y'all right, so i'm here um and i think i'm one of the first people here but um yes i'm i'm nervous i don't know why i'm nervous but um I'm also excited because we're about to be learning a lot and I pay some good money for this class and yeah. Look at the locks, y'all. Right. Honey, they pulling up now. But I'm excited to do my um my retwist for Thanksgiving. Honestly, I've been thinking about it. I don't know if I'm gonna do like a whole retwist or like oh my god. I don't know if I'm gonna do like a whole retwist or just the front. I really don't know. I don't know. I kinda wanna do something different this retwist. Like I don't know if I wanna do two strand twists, like maybe just regularly 
retwist my hair, but mm, we'll really see. We'll see. But yeah, y'all, I was just saying that I got on this my regular Normani shirt. I thrifted this with these jeans that I thrifted. Also, I love these jeans. They fit me so nice. With my Doc Martin slip, uh, Doc Martin sandals on. These my favorite sandals. When I was walking on the door, I was like, "Ooh, them sandals so cute. They look so comfortable." I'm like, "Thank you, sis." Hold on. Y'all. it is 8 45 i'm on the way to um a client's house y'all i really do not like early morning appointments like i don't and i be thinking about like taking it off to where they can't book that early but at the same time like the early bird get the worm you know even like it's just like i don't want to do that and i need to just start waking up earlier which i do wake up early it's just the fact that an appointment be set at a certain time so you gotta wake up earlier than that then you gotta get ready it's just it just be a lie and it's just like bro i don't want to feel like i'm going to work which i don't like i don't i like doing locks it's not nothing bad i like making money but y'all yeah, just really don't be liking early ass appointments but i got a busy ass day today right before i left i had to print out the um shipping label for the giveaway winner and i'm dropping that off today and then i have to go all the way to the north side to pick up my certificate y'all because i am not a certified lot and then i don't fly with me like y'all it's so crazy and the workshop was so informative and like so just well put together and nice like i felt really like happy that i took the class and like i was learning a lot of stuff that i really didn't know at first i feel like i'm getting faster i feel like every client that i've had told me that i'm pretty quick y'all and i know i look rough y'all i'm doing my hair today thanksgiving is tomorrow i'm doing my hair today because y'all i've been doing everybody else here getting them cute and i'm over here looking roughy toughy but yeah we're gonna get to that later but as far as the workshop yeah it was a really good workshop I learned a lot of new things like i was saying clients usually tell me that i am pretty fast when i do hair but i feel like the techniques that i've learned at the workshop i've gotten a bit faster because i had uh a client yesterday i started her locks and then oh my god speaking of her y'all i'm all over the place but speaking of her if you follow me on my lock page at lock lady 444 you'll see that one of my clients gave me such a cute little gift, y'all. She gave me this shirt with um, a lady with locks and glasses. And she was like, bro, it looks like you. And like, when I posted it and when I showed mama, she was like, bro, is that you? Is that you? I'm like, no. But she even said it looked like me. And then she gave me sage. And she gave me, um, uh, she gave me sage. She gave me incense. She gave me a lot of cute things. And like, it was just really nice of her to give me that. Bitch, is that a police? That is a police, okay. Um, why the fuck are they in the Kia? Okay, anyways. She gave me a lot of cute things, and we just had a- In really one mile, session. turn right onto Buffalo Run. Like, just keep going with your YouTube. Like, I really love your YouTube. And that should just be really making me feel good, because I be really hard on myself. Because, y'all, I was been supposed to post, like, a, a starter lock type of video of, like, how you should start your locks, depending on, like, your length and hair type and whatever. And I'm still going to do it, but I just felt like the video- I don't know i'm just very hard on myself and i just want it to be like way better than what it is so i'm gonna re-record the video because i learned way more at the workshop now about some of the things that i was talking about so i'm gonna re-record that video but yeah she was just telling me that like i'm doing really good and just keep going and stuff like that the workshop was really nice i'm glad that i took it i'm glad that i'm getting a certificate i just hate that i gotta drop all the way to the north side so i'm gonna go ahead and get that today honey because i want that like i want to have it in my hand you know so i could feel like that bitch so yeah i'm thinking about doing curls for thanksgiving i want to do something different and i also don't really want to um i also really don't want to like retwist my whole head i'm really not that pressed like i might just do the perimeter of my head like just the front because that's what i did to my dad i did my dad hair yesterday and he only did the front 
and I was thinking like not even doing a retwist at all but I think I'm gonna I think I might just do the front of my head but I do want to try some curls I think that'll be really cute the only thing that I'm scared of is that it might not dry all the way and it's gonna be real real tight curls and I don't want to look like a grandma or a little kid so like I don't really know how this gonna go but I kind of really do want to do um at the next light curls. turn left I have not gotten any sleep like I didn't get no sleep last night I didn't get no sleep the night before and I'm just really tired like I'm this is my last client well this is my only client of the day because I blocked off the times after her because I need at to the get light. myself together and I also want to record a video I want to record me doing my hot oil treatment I want to record me doing my hair like I want to do a lot of stuff so yeah. I'm almost here hold on y'all hey y'all so I'm literally finally back on my side of town I forgot to record when I was done with my client and going to um going to pick up my certificate look at my certificate y'all oh shit hold on the light green omg y'all so i literally just came back like i said y'all i freaking hate driving to the north side like that was just too much and it was traffic and it's not even like traffic time like it ain't even two o'clock yet and it was just so much freaking traffic but i'm finally back on my side of town y'all i'm finna go home and relax for a little bit before i start on my hair i'm gonna have to go back out again because i gotta wait till my mama get home from work so I can get the um shipping label so I can ship off this package and yeah I'm just so freaking tired y'all like oh my gosh I didn't even get like I said earlier I didn't get no sleep or nothing like I'm ready for Thanksgiving though just so I can relax be around family eat some food and chill y'all usually I be going all out for um Thanksgiving for my outfit but this year I'm literally going to wear the shirt that one that my client gave me because they want us to wear fall colors which I always wear fall colors for Thanksgiving but they want me to take pictures this year so they all want us to like coordinate I guess so I'm gonna just literally wear the shirt that the client gave me I think it's just so cute and it's chill you know I usually always dress up real real cute so this year I'm gonna just be on some chill shit but um, I'm going to a friend's giving this year, and this will be my second one ever, and I'm really, really, really excited. My best friend is in town. I'm so freaking happy, and that's going to be on Sunday. So, I'm going to dress up cute for that one, though, because it's like, you know, it's going to be a friend's giving. We're going to be turning up. We're going to be drinking and stuff. So, it's going to be a real fun, cute little thingy. So, this, this whole week been so busy, but I'm very grateful that I am busy, and I'm getting in work you know putting in work for the things that i want you know working hard in life so yeah i'm gonna show y'all my certificate when i have time to i'm still driving i'm like so hungry like i'm not like so hungry but okay i'm gonna show y'all right now because the light is red now okay y'all so here is my certificate Certified girl was good. Certified lock lady was good. Don't play with me. Price going up. Don't play like that because really, my price is a little too low. And since I'm certified now, bitch not gonna be fucking with me no more. So just get ready to pull that money out your wallet when it's time for the kitchen. I had done mommy. Nah, I'm playing the buck for real though. Like my price is going up. You feel me? But I ain't just money hungry. But like, mm, you know, I need money that's worth the work that i give but yes i'm just really excited for this journey i am certified now so my next goal in life is to get my own little studio i thankfully and gratefully have a spot in a shop that my dad works at so i can go there soon but i i, I might what is this on my door I might um continue to market myself like as a travel optician. I can make more money like that. And but you know, I, I still am gonna go to the shop, but I was thinking like maybe I should do that too. But yes, y'all, the workshop was really nice. Um they fed us, they gave us a complimentary breakfast and lunch. And for lunch it was Jamaican food, and that was my first time ever, 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 ever having Jamaican food, and it was like so fucking good. Like that curry chicken was good, like it was really good. That curry chicken rice and peas they had plantain it was a little too sweet for me like i've had the um crunchy plantain like the chips but like i never i think that was my first time ever having a plantain like the real ones 
and it was just too sweet for me like i don't even really like sweets like that so i already knew like i wasn't gonna like it that much but i just tried it but y'all it was really good that was my first time having that i was not expecting them to have that i didn't i mean i didn't know what to expect but i really didn't think it was, it was gonna be that and it was from a place called cool runnings if you're in houston you know about that i've never had cool runnings and that's what it was and it was good but y'all we learned like different styles like i learned how to do lock pedals and it was it's so crazy when because like you'll see some lock styles or just anything in general you'll see something and you'll be like damn that's that's hard to do like man i don't know if i can do that and then you see it and it's like oh it's just that so y'all i'm just excited to be trying like different styles on different people now i learned different techniques on like how to do coils on how to like keep coils to stay in place without a clip i learned different things about like what to do with starter locks how it should look how it should be their maintenance like how how soon it should come back and get maintenance i learned about pricing um i'm i think i'm gonna give me a mannequin head um to practice on at home i'm gonna think i'm gonna give me one off amazon but um yes y'all like i learned they have some good products there i think i want to invest in some of their products that they have because they have like their own thing of products but it was just a really 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 good workshop and i'm very glad that i invested in it like seriously like i'm really really proud of myself that i did that and it's so crazy i was being a loctician was not in my plan i was like yes y'all i'm gonna become a loctician like no like I don't even go to a lactation. There aren't people out there like me that do their own hair and like they need help. And I get so many, so many DMs asking me questions about my hair. Asking me questions, you know, how should they start their hair? Just so many questions. Y'all, my lips is probably chapped the whole damn time, but oh well. But yes, I be getting asked just so many questions and I just feel like becoming a lactician, becoming certified, me being on YouTube, me having my blog, me being on Instagram, like I feel like it's helping people and people always tell me that, you know, my videos and stuff help them. So I'm just glad that I can help people and I'm doing something that I like. And y'all already know my journey with quitting my job and all that stuff, like everything is just happening in due time and i'm just grateful for it all and i'm going to take advantage of this shit and it's gonna be so much more coming in store y'all like y'all not y'all not even ready like what's really about to come for real for real like i just had to sit down and write it out because it's just been in my head i haven't really just sat down and write it out because i just don't want to get too ahead of myself and like i don't want to um just think too hard about it i just want to just continue doing what I'm doing. Just continue working hard, marketing myself, putting my work out there, and just you know everything will come in due time. Like I said, I'm home. I'm about to go up in here, um, and lay my ass down. Uh, and yeah, I will talk to y'all when I just feel like picking up this camera. Uh, so I just chill for a little bit, and now I'm just getting all the um oils together that I'm gonna use. I just got all the oils together that I'm going to use for my um, hot oil treatment. Don't mind that in the background. I had a client come here the other day and I just never took it out of my room. But as I can see, I took that big ass table out of my damn room. And this chair is going to leave too. Y'all, I'm redoing my whole room, okay? Like, all this little zebra pink stuff is about to be out of here. I'm going to do neutral tones, plants, greens, browns. Like, it's going to be a whole different thing. That's a whole project that's going to be coming soon but yes so the oil that i'm going to be using y'all i just found some oils around the house because y'all already know how my morning went i do not feel like going nowhere even though i have to go somewhere because i need to go drop off the package and my bestie is coming down here so i can see him um yeah so i don't feel like going nowhere right now so i'm just using what i have so i got some coconut oil I'm going to be using black castor oil. I'm going to be using olive oil. I'm going to be using avocado oil. I honestly don't even know if it's any in here. I can't tell. I don't think shit in here. That's fucked up. But yeah, it, yeah, I'm going to just be using these three. And I probably might look up and see if I could put something else in here. Probably like some conditioner or something or like. I don't know just something because I just feel like my hair is really dry and I just want to give it a good good hot oil treatment y'all before I style it 
so like i said i think i'm just gonna go ahead and do like some curls i'm just really nervous i just don't want it to be like real shrinked up but honestly i ain't gonna know the choice y'all people be thinking that my locks are fake do they do they give y'all fake Do they give y'all fake? Because honestly, I've been every time somebody see my hair, they be like, is that your real hair? Is that your real hair? Is that your real hair? Yes, Miss Mamas. This me. This me. This me. Okay. Like somebody told me like my hair look like butterfly locks. I was like, oh really? Is that so? Nah, this me though. Even though I said that I um I was gonna put on a screen the um the little gifts that my client gave me. I'm gonna just show y'all again. Cause I'm just, I don't know. I'm just so happy and I just love it. So she gave me this shirt. It's so cute. And I got it in a large. She was trying to give me a small, but I told her, can I get a medium or a large? Because I like oversized shirts. So she gave me this cute, cute, cute shirt. And everybody who's seen it, they like, is that you? Is that you? And I'm like, girl, no. But even she said it, she was like, that look just like you. So she got me that y'all. And then she got me um some sage it's my first time ever having sage my dad used sage and used to come in our rooms all the time but yes yeah, so this is my first thing of sage and then i can't remember what these are called but if y'all know y'all know and then i got some incense i've never used incense personally but um i'm gonna start and then this is her business card so make sure y'all go shop brie retro this is not sponsored obviously she gave this to me out the kindness of her heart and i really appreciate it but it's brie retro she has a lot of cute stuff on there if you are pro black honey if you go hard for your people she got all type of little shirts and stuff on there and yes y'all just really 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 excited i'm just so happy so like i said y'all i think i'm gonna wear this well not i think i know i'm gonna wear this for thanksgiving just on some chill shit and then i think i'm gonna wear it with um my gray jeans or my black jeans and um i'm gonna wear it with my doc martin sandals just something real chill because honestly i ain't tripping you for me like i just want to chill my family chop it up and eat some good ass food i'll probably hit y'all after like the hot oil treatment and stuff is done. I'll see y'all. Okay, y'all. So I just got out the shower and I just got done washing my hair. I just wanted to show y'all um what I use to wash my hair with. I use Pantene. Y'all, like I said, do not mind my nails. They kept coming off while I was showering, but I was gonna do them anyways for Thanksgiving. But anyways, um yes, I use Pantene to wash my hair. I've been using it for years because that's what my mom buy and that's just what I use. So yes y'all i'm gonna show y'all my hair in the room but i just wanted to let y'all know what i use to wash my hair and i'm gonna condition my hair in my room so yeah i'll see y'all there okay y'all so i'm sitting up to record right now but this is how my hair is looking fresh wash out the shower period so i'm gonna just sit y'all right here while i'm um setting this up camera ready to go period and um yeah so i'm gonna get all my little oils together heat it up and y'all will be seeing the behind the scenes of me doing my hair while recording so i'll see y'all so literally i'm a terrible vlogger like i didn't vlog while i was doing a hot oil treatment but um y'all gonna see that video anyway so y'all just gonna go to that video if you want to see that and I also didn't record when I did this. And that's because, y'all, literally, like I said, I was going to put, like, perm rods in there and stuff, right? But I didn't have enough perm rods, so I literally couldn't finish my hair. So I had to figure out another way that I could do my hair to get curls. 
so basically i just did these little lock knots and i tried to record i mean i record some of it on my camera but the camera kept stopping so it's not like a whole full good video so if these come out right i will definitely do a tutorial on it but y'all this is what is this is what it is it's just lock knots all around my head and y'all the rubber bands keep popping out because i have oil in my hair so they just keep on popping but i did not get myself a retwist at all i just did these little curls i have a feeling they gonna come out right but y'all we gonna see we're really gonna see but yes y'all so but i'm gonna hit y'all like when i'm taking them out <coughs> Or maybe after that and then i just show y'all like the end result like me getting ready for thanksgiving and all of that good stuff so i see y'all okay y'all so i literally just took out one side of my head with these little lock knots and look how cute it is i love it So yes, I'm gonna have to do a tutorial on this because I already know y'all gonna want it. So I'm sorry I didn't record. I'm so bad at this sometimes, but I got y'all. <laughs> So now I'm gonna like do my baby hairs before I make it pop and that'll be a wrap for me on the hair. Y'all I'm really mad that I wasn't able to record like because I tried with the perm rounds at first. I got all that footage and then right when I found out about this method And you wanna work no more. Since it came out cute, I will definitely be doing this again. And y'all will get um content then. I might buy my lips. Put some mascara on, but that's it. I ain't gonna put no makeup on because I don't know. I don't really like makeup. Like it's just I don't like it on my face. Only sometimes. Okay. I 
I will still be giving y'all a makeup tutorial. I just be trying to do it when I actually wear makeup. But I guess being a YouTuber, I'm gonna have to do it. Yeah, here it goes. If I ain't gonna wanna go. Hmm. Let me get my other lip gloss. Oh, let me get my other lip gloss. Okay, y'all. So, got my little lip gloss. Y'all, I'm really shocked. This is so cute. I feel really pretty right now. My little lip combo. Who I think I am? Purr. Purr, 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 purr. Okay, y'all, so I need to get dressed because I'm over here looking at my hair too much. But I'm going to take a couple pictures out real quick. Okay, y'all, I'm going I'm to come back. So, this is what the outfit is giving. I'm sorry, I have the worst lighting in my room. But I'm giving it a sidebar cute glasses. I always end up wearing my glasses. And I'm going to glue this nail back on. But I always end up wearing my glasses. Got my little hoops in. Got my little shirt on. And I'm wearing a cardigan because it's cold outside. And then my little jeans and my dark Martin. So, yes, y'all. Okay, y'all. So, it is a day after Thanksgiving. Um, don't mind me in this shirt again. The shirt is clean. I've only been in the house. But, y'all, I was so tired last night. I got home and went to sleep around 9. But, I just wanted to end this vlog, y'all, because I didn't end it off no other way. Um, thank you guys for watching my videos. Thank you guys for supporting my channel and everything I do. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, I hope that you guys come back for more. I'll see y'all in the next one.